So new video shows a close call for a Milwaukee police officer nearly shot during a pursuit. A man running from police back in December turned and fired at officers just feet away. Police fired back. That man died. Rebecca Clough walks us through what happened. Four feet. That's the width of a standard sidewalk, and it's also the distance the Milwaukee Police Union estimates was between a man who was shooting at an officer. That officer, they say, could have easily been killed. We do want to warn you that the video you are about to see is graphic to some. This dash camera video shows a high speed pursuit with Milwaukee police back on December 15th. Police say 23 year old Keen Walker drove off when they tried to stop him near 47th and Hampton. Correction 47 in Hampton. Police chased the car for more than two miles. In the video, you see the car crash, then Walker takes off running. Police say he fired multiple times at officers, which you can see by the flashes in the video. I don't know how an officer wasn't killed during that situation. I see how close they were. The president of the Milwaukee Police Union says when he watched the video, he could see it took a second for the officer to react. You can see the suspect pull the gun, fire a shot, and the officer didn't go down to the ground right away. It took a split second before he realized what was going on and then he rolled on the ground. Three officers were involved in that shooting. Chief Morales spoke that night about what happened. Upon uh, striking uh, what I believe is a light pole, the suspect exited the vehicle and immediately fired shots at officers. Three officers fired back. Walker was shot and later died at the hospital. A loaded gun was recovered at the scene. That split second, anything can happen to us on the street. The shooting is still under investigation. The officers involved are on administrative leave.